of thesis. So I alluded to this earlier, um, a literature review, <laughs> I feel like I need some kind of segue here, but I don't know. Uh, it's a little, little clap for everybody doing like, a, you're doing, getting through the, the projects. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> Oh, um, Bertha, be sure to check out our um, our web pages and such, um, because we do have a lot of information on the thesis and the formatting manuals um, are available on on the web page there. So, awesome. What about you, Ashley? Are you going to stick around for the rest of the thesis stuff here? Oh, there's somebody else in here too. I'm sorry, I didn't see you there. Oh, interesting. Okay, then I'll go through this fairly quickly. So what is literature review? A literature review is where you take all of the literature that you've read for all the sources that you've put together and you stick them together into something like a chapter or a section in your book or your dissertation or thesis. It's usually the chapter or section after the introduction or chapter one. Some people make it part of their introduction or chapter one. For other people, it is their chapter two. Um, and it's not all, not all um, projects have a literature review, but I feel most um, modern ones do, um, mostly because uh, it's a staple of the forum. Like, your advisors and your committee want to know that you did the work and you read all these things rather than just like skipping them. Um, they, they usually know also um, about the topic, but sometimes they don't. You know, sometimes your advisors are not fully aware of the specific niche um, portions of the topic. So it's good for you to have a literature review in case not everybody's an expert on every element of your thing. Um, and 